Now, the events of the tribulation are described in Matthew 24, Mark 13. He says, Then shall be great tribulation, such as was not since the beginning of the world, no, nor ever shall be. He describes the tribulation, and then he says immediately, After the tribulation shall the sun and moon be darkened, and on and on. Now, those who believe in a pre-trib rapture, they believe that when God pours out his wrath in the book of Revelation, they believe that that's the tribulation. They say that the tribulation is when God pours out his wrath. But what's interesting about Matthew 24 and Mark 13 is that they both describe the tribulation and none of them describes God pouring out his wrath on this earth. For example, when you read Revelation, you know, you read about the seven trumpets and the seven vials of God's wrath and you've got the sea turning into blood. You've got the rivers and fountains of waters turning into blood. You have men being scorched with great heat. You have these armies of, of, of locusts from hell stinging and biting men and men wishing that they were dead because they're in so much pain from these locusts from hell. You have these, these 200 million horsemen that are, you know, have all this fire and brimstone breathing and smoke and death. And I mean, there are so many things that are described when God's pouring out his wrath that don't show up at all in Matthew 24 and Mark 13. So if those things are supposedly in the tribulation, then why did Jesus never mention them in Mark 20, Mark, Matthew 24 and Mark 13? Because when you look at the events of the first six seals, they line up perfectly with what Matthew 24 talks about and Mark 13 talks about. They all line up perfectly because at the end of the sixth seal, that's where the sun and moon are darkened. And that's what the Bible calls after the tribulation. So the seven trumpets and seven vials of God's wrath are after the tribulation. That's why they're not talked about in Matthew 24. That's why none of the events of the seven trumpets or the seven vials of Revelation show up in Matthew 24 or Mark 13 at all, even though Matthew 24 and Mark 13 describe the entire tribulation period. That proves that God's wrath will not be poured out during the tribulation, but rather the tribulation is a time of man persecuting the saints, the devil persecuting the saints. I mean, read, read Revelation 6 and it lines up perfectly. Read Revelation 8, 9, 10, 11 about the seven trumpets or Revelation 16 about the seven vials of God's wrath. It doesn't match up at all with what Jesus talked about because Jesus was talking about the tribulation in that passage. And those events are God's wrath. Two different things.